Hey everybody, Cynthia here. I'm here to share my um, 109th personal Cricut challenge. And I do these personal Cricut challenges with my friend Misha at Scraps and Things 1. Hi Misha! I will post a link below this video to her channel so you can head on over, check it out, and um, get some more inspiration. So for this project we were to upcycle a soup can, a coffee can, any kind of can we wanted into anything and we needed to use at least one image. So I used the Alphabet Cricut cartridge. This one's actually already stored into my machine when I got it. I have the Cricut Expressions too. Um, yes, <laughs> I just wanted to make sure it was two. Um, and I used the font in it and okay I'm gonna show you I'm gonna try and show you the can I did this for my husband for his work um, I altered the coffee can I'm just gonna give you kinda like a sneak peek look at it okay I'm gonna pick up the camera and I'm hoping I don't make y'all dizzy but here is my coffee can it's the big one Okay, so if you can see up close, this here I used for his, um, it's, it's like, it looks like a Santa suit. And for the waist, or the jacket part here, which is usually white cotton, I had taken white cardstock and I kind of just tore up the edges and I glued it on. And I didn't really, I liked it, but I thought it needed something more. So I went over it with this Snowtex by Deco Art. And as you can see, it came out really nice on the can. And then while the Snowtex was wet, I pushed in these two gold buttons. And then I made the belt buckle out of this gold, um, like a, it has like a gold foil in it too, paper. And then I just used black cardstock to go all the way around the can. The can I painted with white gesso first. And then the red I used is the Santa red from Americana Paints. And I had to do about three good coats. And then after I did that, I used the Mod Podge High Gloss Luster. And that's how the can turned out. And then, of course, my, my image from my Cricut is Ho 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 from Santa. So I'll just kind of turn the can around here so you can see the belt is just cardstock. And I used a double-sided tape, and it's really stuck on there really well. And then inside it, um, I put in this Christmas tree that I picked up from Michael's like quite a long time ago. And this is actually going to go in my husband's classroom on his filing cabinet. So he can have a little tree in his room. Everybody in his room this year celebrates Christmas. So he's allowed to put up a little tree. So he's so excited. But that is how my altered can came out. And I was inspired um, to do the can from a lot of different ones that I've seen on Pinterest. But I actually saw the Christmas tree in the Santa suit can from a Michaels flyer a couple of weeks ago. And I was like, oh, that looks so cute. I want to give that a try. So that's it, guys. That's my project. If you guys have any questions, let me know. And thanks so much for watching. Take care. Have a great day.